Hi guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Let's do a daily real quick, okay? For um for tomorrow for the tenth. For the tenth. I hope everyone's doing great. I hope you are. I'm struggling with my back, guys. So I'm just trying to take it easy and it's tough. It's tough. tough to just sit here so I'm just gonna bang out energy okay January 10th 2019 January 12th oh I just said the 12th and it's the 10th it's a night of pence so it's a message this person likes green it's more than just the earth, okay? Um, a decision is going to need to be made. It won't be taken lightly, okay? I, I think this person's coming in. I don't think they're all, like, happy-go-lucky, okay? But, you know, it's an improvement. But it, it's still very argumentative energy. So when you're in that type of mind space, you know, how are you supposed to make a proper decision? You know, or you could be with somebody else and then somebody else comes in with a message and then you got two people fighting over you. <clears throat> January 10th, 2019. Seven of Chalices. Okay, it's... Oof. Some of you got options. All right, and... To me, it speaks more of confusion because this is your karma. All right, there's a message going in or out, and it has to do with your karma. One more. Princess of Swords. Someone's watching you. You're watching somebody. It's not feisty energy. I usually feel feisty energy with her. But it's not. I, you do have arguments of energy. I don't know what this is. I don't know where she where she belongs right this second. Um, tell me about this Princess of Swords, please. What is she doing here? What is she doing here? It's a chariot moving forward. So I don't know if your back is turned towards this. Because in all retrospect, ladies and gents, you're not even looking in that direction. Someone's just going towards their son. They're happy. I think they're they're like I don't want to make a choice I'm not dealing with no bullshit I don't believe you you know your decision is to go on your merry way so that wasn't a very hard decision for you or they did that spirit saying I'm gonna tell you what you should do I don't know this is bizarre because you're not even you're not even bothered. Here comes that message. It's a little confrontation. But you're like, do to do, do to do, going on my merry way. Just holding on to the string. <sighs> Tell me about this Knight of Pence. Unless I'm reading it the other way how they wanted me to do that the other day too okay how whomever has been watching you okay is now moving forward they've made that now nah, see that wouldn't make sense either though tell me about the knight of pence <sighs> if 
five of pence. So this person's just been before either you or this person has just been sitting under a big old mushroom, under a big old rain cloud. To me, it looks like someone had a little bit of an awakening. So I could see why there's very arguments of energy here because it's like, where have you been? What have you been doing? So this one's a little petty. And if you ask me, it's going in this direction. You know it's petty. So some of you, yeah, some of you are going to turn your back on this. Tell me about the Two of Swords. Some of you will absolutely turn your back on this. It's the star. Oh, so, huh, son of a bisca. I don't think you're dealing with an Aquarian. I think it's divine timing is what this is. It's, it's destiny. It's karma. It does not mean you need to be with this person, but it does mean that it needs to be confronted. Okay, tell me about the seven of chalices. What a beautiful star card. I want both of these. All right, the Knight of Chalices. Uh, see, I think you might take a new offer. This is two different energies. It's not the same one. This is somebody new. And that might end up being, or you're going to battle in your head. Like, fuck, do I take the new one? Because now we're going in this direction. So now here we go, like I said, with the two energies. All right, the Hierophant. Somebody's going to come in and charm you. And it's either going to be a very spiritual connection or it is going to be a connection that leads to a commitment. Clear as day. So we're going to have two people here. Your past, which you know is petty, that I think you're turning your back from. And this new one, I don't know if you're going to choose them either. I don't know what this is. This is not the divine. I don't even think you know about this. this someone's watching you. Because it cuts everything off here. I don't even know what she's doing here. Somebody's about to come in. You don't. Someone's been watching you. I don't even know if you know this person. It doesn't have anything to do with these two. This is the third person. I've been feeling it the last couple days, that third party energy. Could be somebody you work with. It could be a neighbor. Someone's watching you. What does this person want? Tell me about the chariot. What are they bringing? What does this person want? It looks like they're bringing you a flower. They're going to tell you they like you. They're... It's something. It's not going to be bad news, but they're coming. So someone's been on the outskirts, okay? With the seven of wands. Someone's just been watching you. Like I said, on the outskirts, they're coming in. They're a very hard worker. I think what this is telling me, with temperance at the bottom, you might be able to balance this out. What is this? This is somebody's ex, too. For others, it's somebody you don't even know. And you're going to have to stand your ground. They've been watching you. This is a third. You got three energies here, ladies and gents. You got somebody from your past that maybe you just left. I don't know. Or maybe you just started dating. Or somebody from your past that you're like, this is petty. I want nothing to do with it. Now you got this new person coming in that wants a relationship. Now you got very arguments of energy right here. But it's, it's so divine. This person is not these two. Holy clusterfuck of energy. Holy cow. Where have I been? What just happened? Knocking on wood. I'm so superstitious. This, to me, is a hard worker. It could have been somebody that was doing construction in your building for the last five months, and they've been watching you, and now all of a sudden they're like, they come and bring you a flower. I'm telling you. This is another energy. It's like somebody's just got a little crush. This is tell me about the seven of wands. This is this is gonna be like a like a like a hold on. This is gonna be like a, a whoa. Can you hold on please? <laughs> it wants to spit it out. Now I'm ready. Seven of wands, seven of wands. Some of you might know this person and others do not. These two right here, that's brand new. That's brand new, that's brand new. But that's just like a little flirtatious. Like, hey, mama, you're looking good. Thank you. <laughs> you know, it's like one of those mailman. It's someone like that. All right, but that, now you got somebody. I don't know who this is. You probably already met them. I feel like this is a good fresh five days, seven days. 
13 days, something like that. Maybe you met, met him around the New Year's. It's something like that. But it, it can lead to a commitment. Or, yeah, because somebody's, but that can be a past past too. Doesn't necessarily have to be brand new, but it could be a past past because it looked like somebody was asking for forgiveness, that whole redemption thing. It's not the same energy, I can tell. I can tell it's not. It's, it's your karma. I think you're dealing with a past, a past, and a present, but the present is just kind of like, whatever. Thanks for boosting my confidence. That's what that is, you know? But this is most definitely not the same person. It's just not. I don't know what you're going to do. You might not even have ran into him yet. It might be another 13 days, 5 days, 7 days. It's something like that. But you do have a divine connection here. And I think it's the petty one. And what it's trying to tell me is that it can grow. I don't know. It's tricky. It's tricky, tricky, tricky. Ooh, shaka, shaka, shaka. Something, something tricky. Ooh, it's tricky. <laughs> Remember that, that movie, Road Trip? Remember after he has, like, sex for the first time? With that the big girl, what's her name? I don't know. But remember what he puts in his pocket? <laughs> Any hoozy. I'm not going to say it online. I'm going to get, um, I'm going to clarify each person. I'm just going to clarify the energy real quick. Oh, my back is rocking. All right. Tell me about this Knight of Pence. Best advice for this Knight of Pence. Best advice for this Knight of Pence. Best advice that this Knight of Pence. It's the Page of Cups. Somebody's got some feelings for you. And they're, they're coming on the horse. They're coming on the horse. Alright. So this person that's just kind of been like crying over spilt milk. Coming at you. And if they need to fight for you, they are. Look at how this is going. Hello. Hello. That one was really stuck to the table. They got to fight for you. They're fighting for you. Looks like this person had an awakening. I don't know what that's all about. But if they need to fight, they will. And this is somebody new. Tell me about this new one. Tell me about this Knight of Chalices. This person's going to want a commitment. It's the Four of Pence. So that's... To me, you've been holding on to your karma. And considering she's flying, you're about to let it go. You guys are going to take the new. Some of you guys are going to take the new. Tell me about this four of pence. Because it's saying release, and, and I, that's what you're doing. You're like, I'm done. You're like, I'm done with that bullshit. I'll be right out. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, no, go for it. Um, They're freeing themselves. They're not holding on no more. They're releasing. All right, to have that new. Yeah, see, Queen of Pence, she's going in looking right at him, too, with a bull. She's no joke, either. She's going to take that new one. A lot of you guys are going to take the new one. Even though you know that this one might be divine, I think there's been so much growth that you got to do what's best for you because this one hasn't popped in, but they will. Um, you know how I've been talking about that for a while, guys, and you're like, I don't even have nobody. I can't even tell you within the three weeks, if I have any of my clients watching this, tell them court's right because it's, it's happening to them now where they had nobody and now all of a sudden they have two and they're like, what? And they're overwhelmed. And it's very overwhelming, okay, when all that comes at you because that's a whole bunch of karma and brand new stats at the same time, ladies and gents. It's not, everyone's like, yeah, I can't wait. It's not easy. It's like, whoa. But this one, the one that's just been sitting on the shroom doing their thing, tripping out you know, vibe into their own beat, they're going to fight for you. And now you got this new one. I think you're going to want to nurture the new one because you're releasing. You're like, I let go of that. I let go of that. And I think you did it the right way too. Like you cleared, like meaning like you cleared up the karma the right way. You released. It's beautiful. And then you got this Joe Schmo or Tina. 
Sally, you know. Who's this other one? This one's just kind of like somebody in your neighborhood. You're going to be like, for real? They're going to be like, this is like a little player player. Like, ah, oh, you cook? Oh, that smells good. <laughs> you, you got somebody like that as about to hit your ass up. All right, so you got the Queen of Wands with the Page of Wands. So you might just play with this person for a little while. I don't, <laughs> I think you're just going to play with them for a little while. Like, doo -doo -doo, doo -doo -doo. Yeah. It might, I think it's a co-worker. I think a co-worker is going to be like, oh, I brought you in this flower. I brought you in a cookie. I, I brought it's something like that. It's, it's kind of cute. It's kind of cute. Some of you are healing from the past, all right, and you're just. Some of you might just be like, okay, because again, it's another face off. It, so you might just play. I wouldn't recommend. I don't know. You do you. You guys do your own thing, all right. I mean, I'm laughing because I, I, it's it, you're dealing with a character here. You you want to have, like maybe like, you know, a little fun. That that's your person, but I, I don't think you coming in with the the energy of the queen here. And no one, you're not down for that. You you let go. You release. You dealt with bullshit. You know, you've been waiting on this new or at least this one to come back in as new or you want to take new, you know. So, but it's going to be two because this one's going to come in fighting. And I think you're going to take the new. It just depends on your situation, Chip. Okay. Whew, holy overwhelming. I love you guys. Bye.